Just an eagle, you know that it's true. Yeah. What's up guys? Justin Eagle here and I am back with another video. Uh, it's actually a Munch Pack video. Munch Pack sent me a box if you guys don't know who they are. Pretty much they are an American distributor of foreign foods and snacks and just cool products like that. So uh, if you've never heard them, definitely check them out. You can go look them up and you know see if you're interested and whatnot. But we're going to take a look today, see what's inside this box. See what they sent, see what they got, and uh, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoy the video. Let's get it. But as you can see here, guys, this is the top of the box here. You get a munch pack in the mail, kind of opens just like that. Okay, so we got this nice little paper here. Okay, looks like this is some kind of book. Yeah, guys, so here it is. Um, I know that there's snacks under this. We're going to look at them all. We're going to take a look, but I thought I'd go ahead and show you what it's like when you open one. This is like a book with all the products. So yeah, guys, let's get into it. But yeah, guys, we're just gonna take a look at the items one by one, see exactly what came in this box. And then we're gonna look at them in the menu. That way I can, you know, actually figure out where they, what they are and where they're from. So yeah. First item we have here is actually a corn soup flavored Cheetos. You can kind of get a look at that right there. And I actually thought these were from Japan originally, and they're not. They're actually from South Korea, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm excited to try them. I'm not going to sample any of the foods right now. I'm just going to show them to you. But yeah, guys, uh, interesting bag, interesting uh, graphic there with like the soup. I didn't know they made soup flavored Cheetos, so that'll be interesting. The next thing I have here is these cheese balls. Uh, like when I first like saw these, I was like, oh, that, that might be from America. That might be from the States. Wrong. No, they're from Pakistan. And uh, they're Colson cheese balls, Mazala cheese flavored. You can kind of see that right there. And uh, I don't know, it's just like a nice little bag, you know, it's pretty cool. But yeah, uh, the next thing I have is these lots of watermelon jelly kind of gummy things. Uh, they're actually from South Korea and it says, these chewable gummy candies are filled with sweet and juicy watermelon flavor and have the appearance of a cute watermelon slice. So yeah, that's some South Korean gummies for you. This next item, I actually, uh, I recognize the company. It's Cadbury. Um, and uh yeah it's called a curly whirly uh it's caramel covered with rich cadbury chocolate oh that sounds interesting this is actually from the united kingdom uh so yeah i've never had food from there but maybe it'll be good uh the next thing i have here is a yuma bao baked corn snack uh, you know, I guess I could kind of guess at what that is, but I don't really know. Uh, this one is actually from Japan, uh, which, you know, probably explains like the graphic there and then all the, uh, you know, the design of the package and whatnot. Uh, but it looks pretty interesting. Uh, one thing I wasn't really expecting in this box was a drink. I didn't think Munch Pack, uh, would, you know, put drinks inside of boxes or send drinks, uh, just in general. Uh, but this is the Felice Melon Cream Soda. Um, this thing looks pretty cool. It's like, uh, I don't know, it's just got a cool looking can. And the indention is different uh, here as, as, as typically you would see like a pop in the States. And this is from Japan. And it says, with a taste similar to melon, mixed with vanilla ice cream the soda is perfectly refreshing when chilled and a japanese favorite but yeah guys um you know it's it seems like it'd be pretty good and uh i'm excited to try it the next item i have here is is a brand called kiki it looks like it's some kind of tutti frutti um so i guess it's just like some kind of candy uh it's actually from croatia which is uh you know 
interesting because I've heard of Croatia, and uh, but I've never had food from there, so maybe these will be pretty good. Look at this. Are you looking at that? That's haiju. Where's it from, Justin? I don't know. Maybe it's it's from a little place called Taiwan, and it's gum. And uh, yeah, you can kind of see the script right there. I guess that's uh, Taiwanese or whatever language they speak. But yeah, guys, uh, it's gum. I don't typically chew gum, but hey, they sent it. I'll probably try it out eventually. And yeah, look at this cool package. I don't even know about opening this one. This one's, this package looks so cool. I might just keep it like this. But these are par apparently cookies from Japan. How this is a cookie, I don't know. Uh, but it says crunchy butter cookie on the outside, white vanilla cream on the inside, delicious all over. These cookies are unbearably cute, and it spaced out the word bear, so it would it would basically, you know, making a pun off their little advertisement right there. But yeah, guys, that's kind of cool, right? Look at it. Look at the packaging. What is this little scam bar right here? You can see all like, like the nutrition label that was thrown on the back so you know uh, English speaking people can read it and understand it but yeah the next item I have is from the Pacific Desert Company and they are uh, peanut butter chocolate graham crackers so you can kind of take a look there that actually sounds pretty good some chocolate peanut butter graham crackers I'll probably enjoy these and it's actually from the states so these are, are sold here so I'm surprised I've never seen them before um, but yeah, all around, pretty cool little product. This is it, guys. This is the last item in the box. I want to say thank you to Munchpack for sending this out. I'll definitely enjoy it. These are actually from Poland, and this is called a Prince Polo Classic. This classic treat has premium chocolate wafers layered with chocolate, then completely covered with Polish dark chocolate. So. I don't know guys, that's a pretty dope little wrapper. Uh, it kind of it kind of reminds me of like uh, the golden ticket like Willy Wonka would get inside of his Willy Wonka bar. Uh, so maybe there's a golden ticket in here and uh, yeah, I'll get to meet Prince Polo or something. <laughs> uh, but yeah. But yeah guys, just a little pretty short informational video. Thank you to Munchpack for sending this out. And if you guys are interested in it, I'm gonna link their website down in the uh, information so you can go ahead and go over there and check it out and uh yeah guys that's the end of the video if you're new to my channel definitely subscribe hit the like button leave a comment hit the bell make sure you stay notified you stay up to date every day i post and i'm gonna just try to be more consistent with it and hopefully i can help you know kind of build up a subscriber base through that but yeah guys have a great night peace